No epic fantasy story is complete without a legendary sword, right? While a tale might still be intriguing without one, let's be real, a great sword has the power to ignite your inner warrior and inspire you to take up arms. Here, we unveil some of the most iconic and revered fantasy swords that have captured the imaginations of audiences worldwide. Excalibur the legendary sword of King Arthur, is a central symbol in Arthurian legend, representing divine authority and rightful leadership. Its origins vary, with some tales describing it being given by the Lady of the Lake and others depicting Arthur pulling it from a stone. The sword's magical properties, including a protective scabbard and blinding brilliance, elevate it to a symbol of justice and unparalleled power. Andariel, Reforged from the shards of Narsil, is the sword of King Aragorn in J.R.R. Tolkien's The Lord of the Rings. The sword, also known as the Flame of the West, symbolizes hope and the return of the rightful king. Its radiant blade and storied past make Andoril a powerful weapon and an emblem of Aragorn's heritage and destiny. Stormbringer is the sentient, vampiric sword wielded by Elric of Melnibon in Michael Moorcock's series, granting immense power at the cost of consuming souls. The sword's dark influence drives Elric to acts of violence, highlighting the themes of power and corruption. Stormbringer's ultimate fate intertwines with Elric's destiny, embodying the struggle between chaos and order. Ice is the Valyrian steel greatsword of House Stark in George R. R. Martin's A Song of Ice and Fire series. The sword symbolizes the honor and power of House Stark and is used by Eddard Stark for executions and in battle. After Eddard's execution, ice is melted down by House Lannister into two swords, symbolizing the shifting power dynamics in the realm. The Buster Sword is the massive weapon wielded by Cloud Strife in Square Enix's Final Fantasy VII, its distinctive design and size symbolize Cloud's strength and troubled past. The sword is iconic in the gaming world, representing the enduring appeal of the Final Fantasy franchise and its epic narratives. The Sword of Gryffindor, from J.K. Rowling's Harry Potter series, is a goblin-made weapon imbued with magical properties and associated with the House of Gryffindor. It appears to true Gryffindors in times of need and absorbs what makes it stronger, such as Basilisk Venom. The sword symbolizes bravery, chivalry, and the fight against evil. The Master Sword, or the Blade of Evil's Bane, is the legendary weapon wielded by Link in Nintendo's The Legend of Zelda series. Forged by the goddess Hylia, it is the key to defeating darkness and is only wielded by the chosen hero. Its radiant energy and divine symbolism make it a beacon of hope and a central element in Link's heroic journey. Yamato is the dimension-cutting katana wielded by Virgil in Capcom's Devil May Cry series. It can create dimensional rifts and symbolizes Virgil's precise and calculated nature. The sword's connection to the brother's legacy and the themes of power and control make it a significant element in the series' narrative. Sting is the elvish short sword found by Bilbo Baggins in Jair, Tolkien's The Hobbit. Its blade glows blue in the presence of enemies, making it a useful tool for Bilbo and the dwarves. Sting symbolizes Bilbo's transformation from a timid hobbit into a brave adventurer. The Atlantean sword is the massive weapon wielded by Conan the Barbarian, originally forged from a meteorite. It symbolizes Conan's warrior prowess and his connection to ancient, mystical forces. The sword's iconic design and association with Conan make it a lasting symbol in fantasy fiction. What is your favorite fantasy sword? Leave your answer in the comments.